Okay, here I have a Spectrum Controls Universal Analog In. Let's zoom in on the label here so you can take a look at it. And this is a factory sealed unit. And I'm going to go ahead and open it up here. Yep, I'm going to need my uh, Leatherman. We'll slice that open. Try to do this without destroying the package. Hmm. Or cutting myself. There we go. All right, she's open. <laughs> All right, let's uh, see if we can get her out of this bag. Oh, interesting. Holes on each side. Take out the instructions first. Uh, this says it's a quick start. There's a couple screws there. And let's take a look at this quick start and see what she says. This is an input module with heart. Also says a four channel universal input module. Okay, not much there. Just a single page. Okay, well we'll put that one side and let's see if we can get the module out here. And here it is. Let's go ahead and zoom in on it for you. So here we can see the front of the unit with the terminal blocks. Okay, let's take a look at the side and look, take a look at the uh, label. Um, nothing on the top. Oh, what's this? Another label here. Okay, take a look at the back. You can see the connector and the plastic tabs that hold it in along with the screw holes. All right, let's go ahead and put it in here. We'll bring our 830 over. We'll squeeze the top in and take that off. Um, and let's go ahead and put this guy in. Just snap him in. Okay, and there she is installed. And now if I was going to leave her in there, what I would do is use these two screws to secure her. But I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to leave that, uh, that uh, module in this uh, micro. And that's it for this episode of the Automation Minute.